because in one of his memoirs, watch, in one of his memoirs, he described the fact that he knew that ordinary glass is a very significant UV absorber. And so while they're slathering each other with, what is it, zinc oxide for, to, for the explosion, he's in the car and he says, no, I don't need that. I've got the windshield. It's a heavy absorber of UV. And then they have a car. Uh, Bell was fine in the car. And, and then- I didn't know it. Yeah, yeah. And then someone else says, well, but what will protect you from the windshield? <laughs> <laughs> so that was a good rebuttal. So those were two Feynman. So somebody had to know that little tidbit about Feynman and then put it in seamlessly. And, and, and that's not even someone who's, who would they make a big deal of, of for his presence. That's what was beautiful about it. It wasn't like hitting you over the head with it. Like, here's this obscure fact that only we, you know, yeah, just in on the bongos, right? Right. No, yeah. no, 